Welcome back guys, it's CryptoRocko here and in today's video I'm talking about Tron. So I'm going to give you guys an update of what's been going on with Tron. I'll talk about Tron's main net launch and also do a price prediction for Tron in the short term and in the long term. And also I'll share with you guys how I am trading Tron to make money. So guys, if you remember, um, I did a video on Tron a couple of weeks ago where I talked about why I am buying Tron. And, and talked about buy the rumor, sell the news. So when I released this video, Tron was trading at about seven pence, but it's not about the uh, USD uh, value, it's about Bitcoin value. So if you can see, it's about 816 Satoshi, so 816 BTC. And currently Tron is at 962. So that is more. If I, if I sold the Tron that I bought, I would have made a 15% profit on Bitcoin. I mean, we're not trading with dollars, we're trading with Bitcoin. So I'm trying to increase my Bitcoin holdings, not my US dollars holdings. So if you can see, it, it worked, it worked out quite well it didn't work out as well as i would have liked i'll talk about this in the end of the video when i'm doing my price prediction but it did work out fairly well so the question now is guys is it time to buy tron now in the dip before the main net launch or should you guys wait should you huddle or should you kind of fuddle and you know sell and, and fear um and kind of give in to the price because i think the reason why it hasn't worked as well as was as well as it would have liked is because there's been so much fud and bitcoin and the the cryptocurrency market is falling, is consolidating, there's a lot of fud around and bad news around. So Tron is not going up as much as people would have liked. But if you can if you still see guys, it's going up massively against his Bitcoin value. So I mean if you bought I bought it before there, um if you bought it at this dip when it went to about 750, you would have made even more profit. I think I bought it around here. Um, I can't remember exactly when I bought it. But I mean about yeah, I've locked in about ten percent profit. I put a stop loss in, um. So I, if it drops below nine hundred, I've put a stop loss in. So I've about for fifty percent of of um of the ten thousand tron that I bought. So I've I'm 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 in decent profit. So I'm happy with that trade. But again, this is not financial advice. It could go wrong. This is just from my experience, guys. So. Let's have a quick look at this video. So Tron's main net launch is happening in three days. Um, for this article, it's six days. It's it's going to happen on the thirty first of first thirty first of May. It's going to be massive. People are hyping it up. Con Tron is a massive hype coin, and I've got some concerns longer term. So I'm really looking forward to this main net launch. If they can deliver with the such a huge community they've got, this could be massive. So there's a timetable of events that I'm going to quickly go through, and maybe uh, if you want more details, I'll ask you guys to look through it. So some key things that you need to know is I've I've made another video where I talked about what you need to do and how to convert your Tron. So watch that. This is going to be more price prediction and talk about Tron's price uh, rather than talking about uh, what you need to do to transfer your Tron from ERC20 token. So one of the key things this guy's talking about is there's a considerable action in Tron sphere of things for another cool four weeks after the main net launch. So it's not just the main net launch where it's happening on the 31st of May. There's main net testing, there's Genesis block and token migration and everything's happening. You know, there's going to be withdrawals going to be stopped on 21st to 24th. So there's a lot of things that are going on so buy the rumor sell the news it's not just for 31st of may it's not as um straightforward as that so that video that i made probably wasn't i didn't go into detail in this detail but it's still buy the rumor sell, sell the news and it, although you probably wouldn't have made as much profit it's still 10 percent, 15 percent is not a bad trade guys in, in in forex when i used to trade stocks or forex i would have been over the moon with that so i'm, I'm still happy for it and the 26th June is one of the key dates. 21st is when it's going to stop. So you need to be aware of that. Um, so all this thing is quite good and people are kind of hyping it up. So um, in the short term, guys, there's going to be a lot of volatility for Tron. So beware when you're trading. Be careful when you're trading. And now I'm going to talk about Tron in a, in a bit more longer term. So about the fundamental analysis and people are talking about kind of Tron and Ethereum, their rivalry. There was a bit of like a, <laughs> a talking of, of Tron and, and v v Vitalik Buterin and Justin Sun had like a go. Uh, there was a bit of a Twitter brawl between them two. And it was good to see that there was it wasn't taken in 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 a, in too much of a 
negative way because just Justin respects Vital Vitalik Buterin a lot. So some of the things that uh, Justin saying Tron is better than Ethereum at ten thousand to twenty five guys that is very very good trans transactions per second zero fee versus very high fee consistent coin burn versus no coin burn Java versus Solidity strong extensibility versus no ex one billion USD developers reward versus no plan. 100 million users versus small number i mean i'm not too sure about this actually guys but i mean you can see tron has its advantages they just need to deliver guys they really need to deliver uh to to get people to start buying it and then vitalik butrin replied with better white paper writing capability which was quite funny and a bit of tongue-in-cheek so i thought that was quite funny and it talks about products better than uh better than white paper and they go into it in detail and and they they and Justin Sun kind of gave you gave his respect to Vitalik Buterin at the end but I just wanted to show you uh, this chart uh, where where they show it if you if you're interested in this guys I, I highly recommend you kind of go through it and understand in, in a bit more detail where it talks about kind of no experience and the team has experience of developing mobile ends that support hundreds of million registered users it developer rewards it goes into detail so if you want to find out more about it guys have a look through this and maybe read some articles around it so head to head will tron succeed to dominate ethereum it's a long shot long shot guys they're sharing this article again so if you want to find out more read this article Currently, if I had to say who's going to win, I'm massively bullish on Ethereum. I own a lot of Ethereum. I don't own as much Tron. I mainly trade Tron because there are, I've got some uncertainty. But I still hold a good amount of Tron. And I'll see how it goes in, in the future because I, I won't probably sell all my Tron. I wanted to share with you this article because it's a very fairly straightforward. So if you guys knew it, if you are one of the newer people to cryptocurrency, you guys will understand it and learn a bit more from this video. So what can what could drive Tron's price? Partnership, partnership, partnership. That is the name of the game. Although partnership is it's not affecting price as much as, as before because people want to see use cases but partnership is what's going to help tron and um, and justin sun is a great i mean he's he's very good at you know promoting himself he's very vocal on twitter you can see how he's got loads of followers on twitter and he does quite well on twitter you guys also are, are if you haven't followed me on twitter guys follow me on twitter I, I update people on twitter a lot more than i can update on on youtube videos so if you if you if on twitter guys please follow me at rockstar crypto so and main net launch if they can deliver this guys i've been making videos about this if they can deliver this they can they can turn me into a tron believer because i wasn't i'm not i've got some concerns about tron which i've shared in my previous videos and potential about tron's aim is to create a platform where users can freely publish store and own data the plan is to cut out middlemen such as apple stores google pay google play giving ownership back to content creators so they're try their goal is massive what they're trying to do this is a massive goal that they've got but they've got no working products justin sun got his critics because people talk about him as a hype guy he's always hyping um tron massively which could be a good thing but also could be seen as a negative he talks about the marketing plagiarism acquisitions um i don't make it as big a deal as some people are making it but again it's not great for reputability lack of adoption you know there's not much adoption as as, as he's trying to claim or make it out to be so there are some negatives don't just you know this video is i'm not making it to say buy tron make money make read find out about tron yourself and make your own decision guys this is so important what this is one of the channels that's why i don't say follow my advice or buy try i mean even when i made that video i said i explained to you why i'm doing it and i said to you guys do your research before you do it talks about the roadmap roadmap which we've talked through talks about some of the competitions uh, trans com competitors you could talk about facebook i mean i didn't really agree with this uh, competitor as much because they were putting facebook twitter instagram they're so far away i wouldn't even say they're competitors for now even ethereum is really far away tron has a lot of catch up to do but again if they can deliver it could be great so longer term what could happen with tron 
So one of the key things is adoption and then Justin Sun and Tron's team is going to have to play a massive part. Elon Musk to Tesla and um, the Apple, Apple CEO Steve Jobs, there they took that forward. So Justin Sun, I know he's a young guy, but he needs to deliver to take this to the next level with widespread adoption. And that is going to be the key. But currently, guys, excuse me. So, but the trans future is still uncertain. You, it's kind of speculation. There's lots of speculation going on. So it'd be difficult to say if I had ten thousand dollars or a thousand pounds, I wouldn't. If I had only had that much money, I wouldn't risk everything in Tron because it is a very risky trade. And and buy the rumors, sell the news still applies, and there still might be a dip. So what beyond 2018, guys, you'd have to see what goes on uh, with the mainnet launch. If you're really bullish on Tron, if you really believe in Tron. Invest some now and then kind of huddle for longer term because cryptocurrencies are generally undervalued in my opinion. But again, do your own research before applying because this is very risky space and, you know, it could all, with regulation and bad news, it could all go horribly a lot worse for us. So the bottom line is Tron has plenty of promise but will face key, key obstacles in the months ahead. The launch of his mainnet later this year will be important milestone and the one that many in the crypto world will be watching with interest should you buy tron you're the only person who can answer that question so do your own research and decide whether you can think tron is headed for a rise or a fall this is the key reason why i shared this article i'll end on a good note guys i'll talk about some some positives for tron now is trx better than tron we've talked about what they've shared again this is kind of biased because Justin Sun shared it. But it talks about some of the positives for Tron potentially. Can Tron really stand above other crypto? This article again is biased. I said to you, it's a, it's a positive article that I'm trying to share. Again, this 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 is probably saying it's yes. Or Tron has the potential to. Uh, it's already tested this concept recently, launching a test net. Um, he even stated Tron's project has no soul, but in many in Tron's com community believe that he said that because Ethereum has has a lot to lose if Tron's project turns out to be successful. Again, this is biased. This this communication is biased again. But this Tron's main net launch will make it the biggest DApp platform. Uh, on a global scale, all of Tron's previously built dApps will also migrate from Ethereum and Tron will become its serious comp competition. It is no secret that Sun wishes to create an ecosystem lot larger than the one Ethereum has and it will probably manage to do so with ease since it already already has 100 million dApp users. I've, I've, I've kind of raised some concerns around that kind of claim but again do your own research about it guys I've, I've i've talked about this in my previous video tron's team and popularity are growing and i'm i'll have to agree with that because tron is such a popular justin sun is so polarizing and their marketing is so good their plans to get people uh, having their blockchain on tron is great and I, I i mean it potentially could work it's just they need to deliver and and they've got many clever people working from great companies like amazon alibaba and um, trans popularity is going growing so if they can deliver it could be great to sum it up to narrow, narrow it down to four reasons to get on this Tron ride before the mainnet launch. This guys love Tron. So again, this is slightly biased, but I, I wanted to end it on a positive note. Transaction cost is very low. Speed in transactions equals volume. As Tron goes away from Ethereum, it will become unleashed, unleashed from 15 transactions per second to a thousand. Custom smart contract support. Tron's mainnet launch will include support for smart contract contracts. It doesn't even need a custom program language as EOS, Ethereum, or Stellar. Java does the trick, which could be good. These contracts will be easy to develop. They will be highly scalable, fast, lightweight, and fully decentralized. Finally, guys, integration. Tron's new blockchain will go live. It will be fully autonomous and then tron will be able to run apps and issue tokens from for his partners and if people they've got some good plans to marketing plans to get people to run apps and issue tokens on their platform so they might be able to deliver it will will justin sun be able to deliver it we'll have to see this is where your own research comes into play i'd say if you believe in tron 
can buy Tron now, but be prepared for a dip if buy, if buy the rumor, sell the news happens as it's previously played out. So what I said was in my previous video that it, I, I, I see it going to kind of a thousand Satoshi, so where it's at, it's at 900, uh, 900 now, uh, 962. Now I said it should go around about there, uh, one point. 1100 I'd say 1200 would have been too high up but around 1000 to 1100 in my previous video but with the with the market being on a you know consolidating so much it's a risky trade but as you can see guys Tron's back in the top 10 again and whether you if you believe in Tron so my my again this is not financial advice my advice would be and um, what I would do if it was my own money if you believe in long term Tron buy it now if you want to risk it if you want to do a short trade you could probably do a short term short term trade but again do your own research make sure that you know about the markets and know your technical analysis and know how the markets work but if you believe in tron long term i would say still fairly i mean it's almost half price to where it was before so and um, if you if you believe in tron long term it might be a good good place good buy uh, buy now but again do your own research guys this is not financial advice i'm not buying anymore i've already you know made a video and talked about what i did and where when i bought it so thank you very much for watching this video guys let me know what you think what do you think tron's price will be uh when after a couple of days after a mainnet launch or where do you so the question to you guys i've got two questions for you where do you see the price of tron by the end of may and where do you see the price of tron by end of year so leave your comments below and also guys um subscribe to my channel and i'll do half a litecoin giveaway so if you're interested in winning half a litecoin guys scroll down click subscribe turn on the notification button and leave your litecoin address to win half a litecoin so Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have enjoyed this video, please smash that like button. It helps to rank these videos and it helps me out. Um, and also, guys, if you subscribe to my channel for more videos like this where I give trading tips, news updates, um, price prediction, everything that you need to know about cryptocurrencies. So if you have enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, subscribe to my channel, and share it with your friends and family on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, wherever. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Thank you very much.